Tell me all about it again. So, we, we, we sharpen it like this. What's the pan for? We sharpen it. I'm going to try to sharpen this a little bit. The can on top helps sharpen the, the sword? Yeah. It's not getting sharpened. It takes a while. Why? Because it does. <laughs> when Pa was sharpening his tools, he would have to spend all day sometimes sharpening them. Why? Because it takes a long time. Because it's not what super are sharp. Those are trees. Do you see all the circles on the tree? Mm -hmm. That tells you how old it is. How many circles do you think are on there? Don't chase her. I think she wants to play. Her cat fell. You're right. You're being so good with her. Good job, buddy. Aww. I want to pet her. Is she a baby? She's a kitten, yeah. She's purring. You hear? Like, that's a happy sound. She likes you touching her tail. Huh? I think she didn't like you touching her tail, I don't think. I bought for you. Yeah, that's good. Can you show me the roosters? And chickens? Huh? Why is she not moving? I think she's ready for a drink and a bite to eat there. Nicholas, do you want to show me the roosters and chickens? Do you hear the babies you the cheeping? Baby yeah. Do you hear the little sounds? <laughs> and, the, and I saw over here, I think I saw... No, oh yeah, there's a calf back in there. <laughs> Look at that calf, Mom. Yeah. Is there any more animals? Do you know what this is? No. Feel it. It's soap. Okay. And they had to make soap because how they had to do that is first they had to get a little piglet, a baby pig, raise it up until it was big and fat, and then they had to butcher it to make ham and bacon. 
Okay, and rub this up and down. Okay, you can go ahead and rub it up and down on there. And then you saved all the fat from the pig. Keep rubbing it, scrubbing it real, real good. And they took the fat from the pig and they made it into lard. And then this barrel, see? They collected rainwater in a barrel outside like that and put their ashes from the stove. Keep scrubbing. Keep scrubbing. You want it really <laughs> clean. Why? <laughs> you have to get it clean. Yeah, up and down, up and down. Yeah. So um, they would put their ashes from the stove in there to soak to get the Am I all done? And then, um, then they would um, take the lye water, they'd skim out the ashes and stuff, and then they'd take the lye water, put it in a big, huge pot, um, over a hot fire outside, boiling it to make it strong enough to make soap out of it. To check to see if it was strong enough, they went to the barn, grabbed a chicken feather, dropped it in. If it dissolved, it was strong enough. Huh. If it didn't, keep boiling away until it does. Huh. Another way, if they didn't have chickens, but they bought eggs from the neighbor or something, um, they could take the, an egg and drop it in and if it floated, huh. that was a sign. But then, of course, you don't want to eat the egg. Right. <laughs> and then you'd put the pig fat as well as the rye water. All right, right. so we stick it up here. You want to come to the other side? Yeah. And then they would mix it together. Come around over here. To, uh, make soap. And Laura describes that their soap was brown and mushy, you know, or mm -hmm. in the stories. And that's how it would be if you didn't have the um, right amounts of, of lye and of lye and what? Lye and uh, oils. Mama, can you please help? There you go. Keep going. Okay, and then this is the rinse water. So when it comes over here. This kind of looks like a plunger, doesn't it? Yeah. But it's called an agitator. Did your washing machine have a thing sticking up in the middle of it? No. No? Well, if it did, that would be called an agitator, too. And this is what um, they use instead of a washing machine. All right, now it's probably all rinsed out. So you want to try cranking that handle again? Crank it the other way this time. Start cranking. And then Ow. keep cranking. And I'll catch it so it doesn't get wet this time. So you want to put it on the clothesline. Over the end, will we dry it? Mm -hmm. Yep. That was their dryer. Clothesline. Here you go. Go hang it up. Don't drop it in the dirt, because that means you'd have to do it all over again. Uh, you'll need some clothespins. Mama and Popo have a clothesline in their backyard for drying clothes. They don't really use it anymore, but they used to. Oh, clothes dried on the clothesline is the best. I like it how crunchy, the crunchy towels. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. And maybe he's going to do the pony wide. Get your head in a circle. And you kind of throw it on there. Whoosh. Yourself. Well, you last <laughs> That's a good Then you can tighten it. See, it goes through here. See? A big now. Come, come on, Cal. Come with me. Come on. The wagon one is farther. The wagon one goes farther. We'll do that. They go that 
white building over there. Are you gonna see the baby pony? Yeah. Yeah? His name is Cora. Oh, hi. Yeah. Did you guys name her? Yep. Did What's you know this horse's name? name? This is Lena. Hey, Lena. Yeah. She's a good horse. They're all good horses here. Look, they poop. They did poop. We'll have to clean um, that one up. When are they going to eat stuff? Yeah, they'll eat stuff. That's what horses do. Yay! Am I gonna get to go on this way back? Nope. Okay, we're gonna go all the way over here. And now we're gonna go all the way back to the barn. Look at that! Gentle. Why don't you come around to the head here? Very little, isn't she? Yeah. Do you want to go down to the head and pet her? You can. Yeah. I've lived all my life pretty much. What are you Been doing, going there, buddy? The <coughs> to the pageants for the last 40 years. What are you doing? <laughs> and now I finally get to be in the car. Really? Yeah. You won't let me talk. <laughs> no. no, I just got an action card. You know, the pageant this year is. On the bank of the Keep going. Oh, it's fine. Oh, one sec. All right, there you go. Where did I put it? In the garbage. In here? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to do it again. Okay, we'll do one more. Okay. Wait right till it is. Opposable thumbs, son. Opposable thumbs. Found a big one, huh? I 
Okay, what color do you want? Blue. Blue? Okay, what color string do you want? Green. Green. There you go. Is this all you need? Yep. All you need to help make something. Like this? Okay, you're gonna put that like that, and then you're gonna put the corn cob like this. Now just a little bit. Oh, bless you. Okay, and we might need someone to help because this is a big thing. You gotta tie it real tight. That's a good start. And mom is helping me. Yeah. You got it? Like yep. And then all you do is flip it down so it becomes a cape, and you got a superhero. Dolls like that, or you know, ninjas. <laughs> so, yeah, boys aren't too keen on baby dolls. I want to put them like a superhero. gonna go back one. It won't come on then. You can go. take it off the hook. That's my next clip. What is so, that? It's a rope. Like a jump rope or lead rope. A lasso. How do you use a rope or a lasso? I'm not for sure about that, but I bet you one of the people over by the horses can show you exactly how. Mm -hmm. I want to go I'm after that. Tammy Joe's still in the little house, but she knows how to make handcuffs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Yeah, thank you guys for stopping in. <laughs>